And Ronnie Cage, who wanted to be playing a yellow or a brown, would, would catch that in his eye line, wouldn't he, that Ali wasn't looking at the table? He didn't have to look at the table, of course. Was you a looker or a non-looker? <laughs> I think if, I think I think when you're when you're not at the table, you're still got to concentrate. You you, you I agree. You're not yeah. you're not you, you tend not to watch the player you're playing, but you just you're focusing on the table because that's that's where you hope to be. That's you you hope your opponent makes a mistake and you're going to get a chance. I think if your mind starts to drift, you know it's um, sometimes you get an unexpected chance and you're not ready for it. Three more frames to be played, and they're very, very important now. I think if you're Ali Carter, you want to win Ali two Carter of them. To break. And of the three frames left to be played, if Ali can win one of them, he'd be certain of having a two-frame advantage going into the final session tomorrow afternoon. And the way things have gone this evening, I would suggest, Stephen, if it did finish all square at eight, I would be very disappointed. Whoa, what a pot. Yeah, he'd be devastated. No, I would be. Eight, three, he was laying the foundations. For getting a big lead. Ronnie was actually playing to stun the cue ball the other side of the blue there, believe it or not. Four. Yeah, so we look at that terrific opening red, but this is a tough one, and it's dangerous should it not go in. But it's gone in, and it's developed the black. Purposely played the cannon. You can feel the atmosphere building, John, in the Crucible. Obviously, there's another match going on, and this, you know, Ronnie's starting to win frames. You can feel the buzz well. rising. <coughs> Incredible venue. Yeah, there's no place like it in snooker. It's pure theatre. Wants to get rid of this red that's just to the left of the black, if he can. 18. There you go. Just a bit of hardboard separating the two tables. This is a more difficult red, but he wants to clear it away from the black. Played it well. <laughs> Wouldn't say he's absolutely perfect on the black. He's got to force this off the top cushion for position. Oh, made it look easy. Made it look easy. Lots of noise coming from the other side of the arena. Got to keep the concentration. I think actually Ronnie enjoys it. 34. Enjoys the noise and the buzz. I was playing for the 35. black there. Yeah, Tester here, and that noise going on. Will he take a step back and just let it die down? He's going to take the pressure blue on. Superb strike with all that's going on. That was a tremendous shot. 40. Ooh. 41. Even Ronnie didn't think that was in. No, that was a, a deceleration. That's what happens, you almost missed the shot thin. Yeah, that was like Bubba Watson in the Ryder Cup. You know, when he teed off and he got the crowd to keep cheering and cheering while he, while he played the tee off shot. That's what that was like there. And Ronnie potted that long blue. Yeah, the 49. noise. Well, and yet the referee will say to somebody, can you put them sweet wrappers away? <laughs>
54. Three reds still needed. Bad contact. Wasn't his fault that time. Well, let's have a look. Yeah, the red came off an unnatural angle. Mm, could this be another big moment? Wasn't able to capitalise in the frame before the interval. He's already he's lost a cue ball straight in the back. It's no good, really. Screwed cue ball by about good six inches. But again, all caused by that first shot, a little careless shot to land straight on the black. Any angle on the black was fine. Yeah, he can pop this red to the middle, but he can't do a lot with the cue ball. If he tries, he could miss the red. Well, all things considered, that was a tremendous oh. shot. That's the best he could have got out of that position. Needs another good shot here. I mean, possibly if you're practicing the club, you, you try and go into the five reds and pink. It's a big target, but I don't think you'll play that here. He'll be trying to get in the circle if he can. Well, he's decided to come down the other side. The problem coming down this side, you've got to be so precise. Well, is there a red 14. below the pink that goes? You can mm. see the red at the, to the right of the pink, I think, was the one he was playing for. Yeah, but this looks like it. Well, it's very hard to say, isn't it? I think it goes. The problem is, can he hit enough of it? Mm, I'm not sure. You see the red to the right of the five. I think, I'm sure, that's the one he was playing for. Mm, this could go wrong. Mm, well done. <laughs> Your commentator's eye, yeah. JB, was superior to mine. Yeah, he could just get through to it, but once again, you see that reaction, so he must have finished the worst side of straight. Yeah, just off straight. So he just can't get this cue ball under perfect control at the moment, which you need to, particularly when the pressure's on, and what a big frame this is now. Love this red to go to the left middle. I don't 22. think it does. <clears throat> you know, he plays for the red to the left corner, and it's a thin one, playing into what we call the blind pocket. You can see the cue ball, you can see the object ball, but you haven't got the pocket in your eye line. You gotta pick out the spot. Well, he's playing safe. He's played safe. Ali Carter, mm. 22. Will he get another chance? <laughs> I would think that Ronnie would be very relieved there. He may think a little bit pacey, but he knew he was sending that red towards the right corner. That's why he gave it a little bit of extra. This red does cut into the left corner. But more concern with getting the cue ball back to the hawk end, but not quite there. Ooh, that was a 
was a dangerous red to go for. And the reason I say that, three-quarter ball pot, if you don't get it, it comes back up the table with the white. And he's left this red on. And Ali Carter's decision to refuse that cut back red has been vindicated. One. Will he take this black on? You'd have to say probably not. Just can't buy a positional shot at the moment. The way he's eyeing it up, I think he is going for it. Could win him the frame, could lose him the frame. Brilliant. Great shot. <laughs> Took a lot of courage to go for it because he's refused easier shots than that. That really was a fabulous pot. It was the frame. If he had missed it. Well, it would only be pressure. That would stop Ali Carter winning the frame of this visit. Yeah, there's not a problem ball on the table. The only problem that could arise is between the ears. <coughs> this is where his technique that he's honed on the practice table all those years stands you in good stead 16. in big pressure moments like this. 17. Eight points behind now. Probably screw 24. back for the blue here. Yeah, a lot easier to get from blue to yellow as Ronnie now can only look on. He's had his chances. Ooh, didn't want the kiss on the black. 25. Well, he's been lucky. Very, he's very lucky. <laughs> very lucky. Why has he played topspin there? That was always going to happen. Because the top spin doesn't take straight away. There's a slight delay, and that's what took the cue ball into the black. Yeah, threw the cue ball wide. And as I say, lucky to be on the pink as he is, or on the black if he chose it. <laughs> and now, just one point, the difference. So he needs up to and including 31. the pink. And if anything can go wrong on these type of clearances, it's 33. brown to blue. If he gets perfect from brown to blue, it's a formality. But take nothing for granted. That boy's heart must have been 36. in his mouth when he played that last red and he's seen the cue ball going towards the black. Forty. Perfect on the blue. <laughs> the pink. Forty-five. For the steel and the big, big frame that guarantees him at least a two-frame advantage going into the final session tomorrow. In it goes. So he rose to the, the occasion there. Tremendous pressure Blackie potted to make the clearance possible. And he's now back to four frames in front once again, this time 9-5.